Welcome again to Adventure Story Channel videos. Today, my dear friends, we will talk about the wipers daily job on board and how the wipers should take the jobs on daily basis from second engineer and how the jobs will be distributed. What this position uh, have as difficulties and how I see also the wipers uh, through the time and through my experience from apprentice engineer, third engineer and second engineer. I like to say that wipers is uh, the person that get almost the lowest salary on the engine room. But the job also it's really, really stressed and also they have a lot of a uh, load through the time they're always pressed by uh, the head staff for the cleaning as much as possible and really really most of these people that are already in these uh, positions they do not even uh, hold the mop itself and clean let's say the workshop only like that uh, they already forget they also forget that uh, they was apprentice engineers somewhere in a uh, past in very very long past but they demand from these people to manage a lot of square meters and in most cases this kind of job is been made under uh, extreme temperatures and conditions their job is not limited for cleaning they can assist also in some uh, technical jobs like uh, overhaulings like cleaning something like here also they can be set it for the lapping of surfaces as you can see wipers also involved here and also to transfer some loads uh, through the engine room or uh, around the engine room or uh, far from the engine room here you can see they are together but this kind of people uh, sometimes will not understand your orders because also uh, it's not the specification and the knowledge level about uh, some kind of jobs always be careful if you are third engineer or a second engineer what kind of jobs you give to this kind of a uh, crew on board the vessel because sometimes uh, they will misunderstand you and it's really really important uh, that orders will be given clear for them and as much as possible try to give them a clear notice about the job and do not load them what i have seen on board the vessel and what i have seen in my last contract i really do not like that thing that chief engineer always uh, give them some jobs and disturb them around the vessel uh, this is not appropriate because second engineer it's the one who will give uh, the order for the people that are working on the engine room chief engineer uh, can only check the process of the work and everything if it's fine uh, most of the second engineers they know exactly how to manage the people uh, on board the vessel and what jobs to give them so it's really really bad when you see a chief engineer and will disturb uh, this crew of wipers because uh, it's really really bad thing and everything will not go normal uh, if there is a external disturbance always on the progress of the work they will be more difficult and jobs will be uh, postponed and delay at, uh, at overall these people must 
Uh, come to the second engineer morning time. Second engineer explain them uh, what they will do uh, with safety precautions. Uh, and this is uh, the daily meeting that we will make together. We will talk about the job itself. We will talk also about the dangers, how many people will be involved in uh, the job that they are making. So also the load must not be so much so they will be also uh, on the end of the work they will not be stressed they will not be also overloaded and so they will go up, they will go upstairs for rest and they will be happy not only the wipers but also the third engineers the fourth engineers the second engineer and the chief engineer but everything starts from the lowest part until the big one uh, the most important is that the people must be rest because in this kind of situations that when we have nighttime alarms or uh, we know also that one wiper making also around on the evening the most of the people from the office they working eight to five but this kind of people they working also saturdays and sundays and also a uh, christmas time and also eastern time also without sunday saturdays sometimes they lose this time so it's really really important not only the wipers also all engineers and it's really important to think that if something happened during night time these people must have some power and also must have a mental physical health good to fight any problem and solve it if the person is not properly rest he will not think about the problem and this is one key factor that most of the chief engineers really really forget about that so this is a really really correct aspect do not overload your person uh, your crew on board because this is really really bad and will lead only to fatigue to body fatigue and wellness fatigue always uh, wipers they are really really stressed because they are going in the most dirty jobs on board the vessel they will clean the tanks the scavenging space uh, and they get the lowest uh, salary okay uh, this is their choice they can increase also the level for going of fourth engineer or third engineer if they like to improve themselves and passing this stage and finish with that dirty jobs but they must also put their mind of working and understanding the system and not only take the position by taking the position and if you are not understanding of what is going on it's really really bad because uh, the people will be which will be done from you will be really really suffer because you will do not really understand uh, what are you doing and this is very very important uh, as the daily job is working and the progress it's uh, on its way our de dear friends will have their coffee time during 10 o'clock and 3 o'clock also they uh, chap chap like they say <laughs> also the evening the dining and also a very very good thing uh, for our friends because they are make also nighttime surveys also they can make uh, checks during the night time to be as much as possible uh, rested 
So everything and all the jobs must be finished until 5 o'clock at least. One good thing that I have done to wipers in previous vessels is that if they are finished the job, the daily job, they can go for rest. And this is a really, really important thing because we have reached the goal and it's not necessary to keep the person until uh, 5 o'clock. It's not any necessity. I have uh, seen people uh, keeping the crew until 10, 11 o'clock without any sense, really, without any sense. And this is the other way, the extreme way of, uh, let's say, punishing the people without any kind of problems that also some of our friends have shared here. It's really bad to see that. Another thing that we can tell that uh, if you have this attitude to this person, they will always be willing to work with you. And also I have a chief engineer in previous companies that he tell me what you're doing with uh, the crew. There everybody loves you and like to work with you. And this is the best way that you can do it's to show that you care about the person you are working with it's really really important that and not only to show but to show in real time that you really really care about them and not only by words okay you are good or you are a uh, very very nice but to be and respect each other uh, independently his uh, position. As we can say that wipers, it's our face also because they clean the engine room, they keep as much as possible and it's really really to program them as I have seen to finish one place or for painting or for cleaning and after progress, 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 step by step to move them around the positions because they will not spend also a lot of time for thinking what to do and they will be organized and they will be also uh, directed in some kind of jobs or aspects which will be planned also from the second engineer and also from the PMS system of the vessel. So only the PMS is not enough for good managing of the person. We also must done and do also this kind of management as much as possible to regulate the working hours and also the, to managing the people as much as possible uh, with respectful and kindness. So I believe also that wipers have one of the most toughest jobs because there is a lot of people on the top of them and there is third engineers, there is fourth engineers, there is second engineers and there is chief engineers and better these persons to be as much as possible under one command because sometimes third engineer also can say okay bring me this bring me that bring me this okay you will not be only third engineer uh, and stand there and waiting for the wiper to bring you the key also the third engineer will go and bring the key and uh, as much as possible to help each other and understand uh, and will not always send the wiper going up and down and we became uh, fat as the whale okay because uh, getting fat it's really really a problem for uh, the marine engineer and this is also really really bad for your health uh, on the future for your heart because 
your heart will be pumping really really hard so keep a good shape of your body because uh, it's really really important that for the marine engineering as you know we have also a physical load and this physical load also corresponds also in our mental health so dear friends i believe here we finish with our a uh, wiper daily job also you can comment on the video and also i will wait for your comments to see what else we have forget and what kind of uh, jobs we can uh, add it to that that i have forget also and how you believe also these persons must be managed as much as possible uh, hopefully also we get some guys which working also in this position to ask them how they like to manage them and how they like the proper way of working i am really really uh, like to hear about uh, what they believe it's, it's really really important to hear everybody and see his opinion and what he think is better for his uh, position so i will see you in the next video we will talk also one day about this valve uh, about what kind of valve is this uh, so don't forget to stay tuned to adventure story channel because more videos coming soon from adventure story channel bye bye